Creating an informal and effective environment for learning. Building positive relationships. Learning is inseparable from its social and cultural context. Marginalised adults who may have previously had a negative experience with formal education learn best when they feel accepted, when they enjoy positive relationships with their fellow learners and tutors, and when they are able to be active, visible members of the learning community. Good relationships are the key to making the Elevation Mini Learning Resource Learning Experience positive and effective. Know your learners. Spend some time in the beginning of the Elevation training getting to know the participants using icebreakers or discuss TV programs, games, food, sport, music, etc. As you learn about the learner background, interests, likes and dislikes, find ways to connect with them through media-based assignments. And remember to let the learners know who you are. Let go of assumptions. We bring prejudice and bias to every relationship. Be aware of how you judge marginalised, low competence or low achiever. As much as possible, let your assumptions go. Let learners be who they are. Be supportive and treat all crew members as unique individuals. Set high expectations. It is important to hold high expectations for all learners, regardless of your preconceptions about their previous experience or backgrounds. Research shows that tutor expectations are a great predictor of success. Be a good listener. Use eye-to-eye contact and avoid standing in front of the group in a sage-on-the-stage position. Rather, engage the learners at an equal level and sit side-by-side when working together. Ask questions and learn about their thinking and problem-solving techniques. Be honest. If you are unsure of an answer, admit it and work it out together, showing that it is okay if they made a mistake and to not always be right. Give positive reinforcement. Give specific praise and provide positive feedback often. Providing sufficient opportunities to learn. People learn most effectively when they have the time and opportunity to engage with, practice and transfer new learning. This means that they need to encounter new learning several times and in a variety of different tasks or contexts.